like the weather, wait 10 minutes. <laughs> and that's something that the filmmaker doesn't want to hear. Wait two weeks, yeah, that would be good, not 10 minutes. So there is a scene uh, on the parking, on the on the car the, um, selling, um, this, I don't know how to say Dealership? It. Yeah, dealership. dealership. And uh, we shot that scene on uh, on Arek, on the, 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 the um, main protagonist, and uh, there was the sun. So we turned the camera on the Zofia, and it started snowing. <laughs> so we thought, let's shoot it with snow on her, and then we'll turn the camera back on Arek to have it in snow. But when we shoot to, 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 to switch the camera on him, it started to rain. And we thought, it's, it, it might be challenging to edit the snow and rain and sun and whatever, so we decided to shoot Alec in rain and then uh, switch the camera on her and shoot her in rain. But then it started to, I don't know, there was some other weather, <laughs> like four or five different uh, ways of snowing and raining. <laughs> So yeah, and so so we were about to. Uh, I mean, our time schedule was two hours for shot that scene, and we did it in eight hours. Because, uh, and basically, we had the scene in each season. <laughs> so we, we can actually use it in other things. <laughs> I will try one more time. Does anyone? Oh, wonderful. We have questions. Uh, do we have a third microphone in there? I wanted to keep in mind, but uh, there is a, another one coming. Where is there? Just Just over here. Right here? Um, maybe so everyone can hear. I don't know. Hi. Um, so you brought up a really uh, important um, issue, obviously, that of uh, workers' rights and how um, immigrant workers were treated in, uh, in Ireland or anywhere out of the country. So do you feel that your film or films in general actually can and do make a difference? Are people talking about the film in Poland? Is there any, um, is there any uh, initiative to change anything right now or to even to look into it more, uh, more deeply? Well, I, I'm not actually, I don't feel like I have the power, uh, maybe the culture in general has it, but I don't feel like I personally have this power to change, you know, the rules that are, um, uh, you know, in those processes of hiring workers or how the construction sites work or whatever, but uh, what I can actually change is the, is the perspective of of seeing immigrants and to understand how difficult, uh, how, how big struggle they actually uh, facing. Uh, and, and how actually, well, how to say that? It's a big, uh, they have to be brave to do that, in my opinion. My brother is an immigrant and they consider that as a braveness to, to go there to a different place speaking a different language and you know to try to find his place there and start his life from the beginning so uh, that may I think that in Poland somehow I started the conversation because we had like a lot of literature and doc some documents showed it but there was no actual feature uh, based on such a story so I hope yes but um, you know I'm not sure but I hope that the culture is changing people's mindset. I hope so. There was a lot of uh, talk in, uh, in, in Poland particularly because lots of young people left to the islands. Yeah, especially my generation. I mean, because that was just after we, uh, we, we, we joined the uh, European Union and like 30 percentage of uh, people my age from my side of Poland, they just left. Uh, to work uh, in um, UK and in Ireland, and Denmark, uh, Belgium, 